A very pleasant day to all. I am welcoming you to participate on our virtual discussion that tackles about introduction and history of marketing. Introduction to Marketing According to Mr. John Paul Parungao, marketing changes a person, economy, culture, and the beliefs of society, and even that of a country. It even changes the face of war, creates leaders as well as politicians, and develops particular trend, pace of life, and face of the future. So, what is marketing? Marketing is a process by which producers of goods and services aim to find out where a demand exists for certain services and products and then find solution to those needs and wants as well as the way to make the consumers aware of the solutions. It is the aspect of business which is most of the consumer focus as all of the principles of marketing relate directly to the consumer. This topic intends to make the principles of marketing teaching learning process deeper but light, meaningful yet fun, lifelong and practical. Capitalizing on the localization and contextualization of each learning competencies and eliciting the real life experiences with regards to the topic to bridge the student's interest and demand of marketing world. In short, marketing can define as a form of communicating or promoting the value of a product, service, or brand to a consumer. And now that we are done with introduction of marketing, let us now discuss the history of marketing. In our module, it says that marketing is as old as civilization itself. You may have seen films with Asian Greece or Rome images with bustling market stalls and traders who actively engage in persuasive communication. Of course, these traders would not have called their activities marketing, and their activities may seem far removed from someone ordering airline tickets via a website. The concept of marketing that we now see has more to do with developments of industrial revolution of the 18th and 19th centuries. This was a period of rapid social change driven by technological and scientific innovation. One of the results that was for the first time, the production of good was separated from their consumption. Mass production, developing transport infrastructures, and growing mass media meant that producers needed to and could develop more sophisticated ways of distribution of goods. In the Philippines, marketing being viewed through barter system. Ano nga ba ang barter system? Ang barter system ay pakikipagkalakalan o pakikipagpalit na produkto. Produkto lamang, hindi ito ginagamit ng salapi o pera. Karaniwang mga produkto lamang ang pinagpapalit o pinagkakalakas ng mga tao dito. Ang produkto ay kasing halaga na o kasing tumbas na iyon ng pera. May mga iba't iba ring tawag para sa barter system at ito yung mga Kambyo, kamkanadse, at tuwayon. Sa mga tuwid, palitan lamang ito ng kalakal o paninda.